fortune in Minecraft. If you're planning on mining diamonds, this is the enchantment for you. With Fortune 3 on your pick, you're going to get lots and lots of items. But what about higher levels, like Fortune 10, or Fortune 100, or even Fortune 1000? How many diamonds would you get with that? Would you ever have to go mining again? And does it unlock any secret drops? Well today, that's what we're going to find out. And if you enjoy this video, don't forget to subscribe. Here we are in the world, and the first thing we need to do, <laughs> before we punch a tree, is get ourselves a diamond pickaxe. And once we have that diamond pickaxe, it will then become Fortune 1000. Although before I could do any of that, I need to find myself some iron. We need an iron pickaxe so that we can mine diamonds. And right on cue, this cave doesn't have much, but it does have a little bit of iron. Also gonna quickly grab some of this gravel, and I can make a flint and steel and begin cooking some food. Don't take this personally, pig, but I'm hungry. There we go. <laughs> this one's not getting to the water. It's not often you can say you find iron before coal, but... Wait a sec. What are you doing down it? It's the pig that led me to iron. He deserves to live for that. I'm not going to make too many things this iron, just a bucket, an iron pickaxe, since we're going to need one of them, and a shield as well. And now we must find the perfect cave to get some diamonds. This one looks kind of promising over here. I was wrong, it was terrible. And <laughs> as is this one. Now this, this looks much more promising. It connects up to a ravine. Perfect. I don't think the ravine's quite low enough, fella. Just, just jump in this water. Yeah, it's taking me down to level 20, so I need to be a little lower for diamonds. And this, to me, looks perfect. Oh, this creeper's trying to ruin my fun. There we go, not to worry. This is prime location for finding diamonds. I've not had much success in finding any diamonds here, so we're going dive mining. Let's swim our way into here. Pick that up, and away we go. A silverfish? Are you kidding me? <laughs> you don't expect to see that when you're just casually mining along. I've stumbled across a cave. And you know what? <laughs> it's a pretty good cave. Four beautiful diamonds. At least four. More than four. Oh my goodness. We only need three. Let's make this Fortune 3 pickaxe. I want to say Fortune 3 pickaxe. I actually mean Fortune 1000 pickaxe. I've got, what? There's more diamonds? This is like the best cave ever. All right, let's go ahead. Put these diamonds here. Put these here. And once we craft this pickaxe, it will have the enchantment. Here we go. And there it is. Fortune level 1000. And now, we shall see just how many diamonds we're going to get. Let's see from one ore. What do you reckon, guys? What's your guesses? Take your pick. Take your pick. I'll tell you what, I'll, I'll pick them up. How many do you think I got? What do you reckon? Let's see. Three and a half stacks of diamonds. How am I going to get from all these? I'm going to have like ten stacks. No, more. I'm going to not have enough space in my inventory for all this. Look, we're living the dream right here. Look at that. I just want to leave the diamonds lying around on the ground. Let's mine up these ones. Oh, beautiful. Is that it? It's only two. I can't really complain. I literally cannot pick up any all these diamonds. Is that many? Look at that. I'm stinking rich, guys. Let's turn all these into diamond blocks. From that small amount, I got nearly two stacks of diamond blocks. And with that, I can craft myself some armor now. There we go. Look at me. <laughs> I'm suited and booted. I will soon build myself a diamond block house. But you might think, okay, fortune with diamonds. That's the best thing ever. It works with other stuff. All right. I mean, it works with redstone. You get a lot of red. In fact, you do get... Uh, well, you get more than you get with diamonds. Same with coal. You just get absolutely tons of coal. We might as well just make a load of coal blocks. Look at that. Yeah, we've, we've already... We, we've not got enough space in inventory for all this stuff. And as I was saying, fortune is pretty amazing with diamonds, but it only goes so far. You can get, like, you know, diamond armor and then diamond tools, and then you're pretty much... You're, you're finished with it. But there's, there's something that fortune is even more useful for. And once we find it, I will tell you. Oh my god, more diamonds? Are you kidding me? This is the luckiest game. I think I've ever had... What on earth? I think I mob. Let's see. How many have we got? Just one, but... I mean, one gives me three stacks. So it's, I only got two and a half stacks. So it's anywhere between like three and a half to two and a half stacks by the looks of things. Oh my god. Guys, I cannot stop finding diamonds in this game. I'm going to have to put this seed in the description. This is the best seed ever. I'm... I'm so... Re you want to steal my diamond? You know what? You know what? You want some stuff? There you go. Go on, put that on. Good sir. Today is your lucky day. Here, yeah, have, have some free armor. There you go. Let's see. Does he put it on? I guess he doesn't want it. You know, you, you could have had everything, sir, but you, you chose to leave it. Well, we might as well burn this now. There's no use for it. <laughs> I think I might be the richest person in Minecraft right now. Aha! I have found what I'm looking for. Emeralds. You may be thinking, SB, why would emeralds be so useful? But maybe in normal Minecraft, finding them, you know, emeralds isn't the best way. But with Fortune 1000, get rid of this water. You know, I'm going to plug it up with some diamonds. Just put those down. I don't know how many emeralds we're going to get. I'm going to gather it's going to be a lot. And we can use these to get things so much better than diamond armor. Here we go. Oh, 
Look at that. Look at that. That is pure money right there, guys. <laughs> Nearly three stacks from one emerald. We just need to find loads of emerald ores. And we can trade for, like, the best enchanted gear, amazing food, tools, you name it. The villagers will have it. And thankfully, this cave that we've gone down was in an extreme hills biome, which is why we're finding emeralds. That's the only biome you can find emeralds. They're kind of pretty rare. But once you find them, it is well worth it. You guys really think you can take me on? Mate, I've got full diamond armor. I mean, I know it's not there. Oh, look at this guy. He thinks with a sword. And here we have some more emerald ore. Let's go and do that. Mine it up. Oh, that was that was a bit of a letdown, that one. That was nowhere near as many as the last time. Also, this one here gives me a bit more. And there's a grand total of... Oh, that's way better. That's way, way better. That other one was terrible. Okay, now we've got, we've got enough emeralds for the next phase of the plan. So now the quest begins to find a village. I've also just realized that I'm still living life like a peasant. Stone tools, what's that all about? Instead, I shall make myself a diamond axe and a diamond shovel. You know what, because I'm rich, we're making a diamond hoe. We have no use for that. No one should ever make one in Minecraft, but but we're gonna do it anyway. You wanna know one of the top 10 places you won't find a village? The ocean, but for some reason we're setting sail. To be honest, I feel like that ruined portal's not even worth me time. Against the odds, guys. <laughs> I've found a village. I'm not going to go there right now. I might as well wait till the night's over. I probably could have just visited the village and gone to sleep, but it's too risky for these villagers. Are you kidding me? There's not a single bit of farmland in this village. The, the entire thing that I was about to show you involved crops, and <laughs> it's not even one here. I'm going to have to find another village. Another village is coming into sight. This one has a blacksmith, and it's got crops. That's all I wanted to see, just some crops. This blacksmith was mostly let down. I mean, when you're as rich as me, what can you be offered in a blacksmith? The obsidians, I guess, are kind of cool, but... Yeah, nothing else of use. There are some carrots here, but I need to wait for them to become fully grown. I don't think this one is fully grown. I shall trade with this fella, since he is going to give me the best armor that I can get. And no, that is not iron helmets or chainmail boots. Instead, it's this diamond arm. Look at that. Prop 2 diamond leggings. They're better than what I've got right now. We'll buy a pair of those. Very cheap as well. Not that many of them when you're as rich as me. The carrots have grown. I can now show you the next phase of my plan. If you didn't know, fortune doesn't just work on ours. It works on crops. Watch this. Oh, it's beautiful, all right? Carrots, oh, you're thinking of carrots, they're not that good, but <laughs> just wait till we go to the nether. I'm going to break this one as well. I have no use for those. You only get one. If it's not fully grown, it's it's a, it's a sorry state. Let's go and plant those. What we need, I mean, I don't need this many carrots even, but it's to the nether we go, and, and, and this is going to be amazing. Of course, I must make sure that I build my portal using diamond blocks, and I just need to find a certain thing in the nether now. I was about to say, of course, I spawned in the one biome that doesn't have it, but thankfully, we've spawned in an okay biome, and here it is. The beautiful nether quartz. So we go and we mine that. Look at that. We've got all the quartz we could dream of. Loads of it. Too much of it, you could say. I gave me a stack and a half of blocks. I'm just kidding. That's not what we came here for. In fact, the quartz is so useless, I'm throwing it away. What we actually came here for, yes, you guessed it. The gold. Look at this. Look at how many nuggets you get. <laughs> it's absolutely ridiculous. And I can now make myself golden carrots. Look at that. A stack. We're, we're sorted on food. You know what? The rest of these carrots, we don't need them. And on top of that, we got so many ingots. I mean, look at this. Look at how many stacks. This is way more than we got when we had looting a thousand. Just those few things. We have five stacks. What? I'm going to make these into gold blocks. That's 40 gold blocks from those. I, I, I didn't even use them all. This might be the most addictive thing I've ever done. You know, guys, after all the thievery I've done over the years from these poor piglins, I think it's time I give back. <laughs> you guys call that a stash of gold. That... That's disappointing. That's terrible. That, that's not a stash of gold. This is a stash of treasure. Now that is what you guys deserve. After everything I've done to you, I'm going to do that. And you know what? I'm also going to trade with you guys because I, I need some pearls as well. I have to say, I'm, I'm quite proud of what I created there. I don't normally get to build with those kind of blocks. I mean, it, it could be better, I know, but anyway, well, you give me anything decent. I think I'm going to, I've got, I've only got one choice here, and that is to make all these guys angry. The gold stash is down there. If I go ahead and mine this block, they're all going to get angry at me. I, I did a nice thing for you guys. You know what? Prepare to be spleefed, good sir. <laughs> all right, well, two dropped. To be honest, I don't know where all the other guys are, but they're not coming over it. I see a lot of good treasure. I see enderpearls. I can't quite believe it, but between, they only gave me seven enderpearls. That, that means I'm going to have to go into your special stash and, and trade it back to you. You asked for it, guys. Now, this time, do me proud. There we go. They, they were extremely quick this time. I think they appreciate what I've given them. I'm going for a swim. An enderpearl swim. Uh, to be honest, this is not a good idea. It's so, so slow to swim in lava. I don't know why I ever thought this was a good idea, but <laughs> when you've got fire eggs, you've just got to. We're going to try and pearl up there. This could go very, very wrong. It, it is going very, very wrong, isn't it? No, wait, it worked. Hey, that was perfect. Look at that. Hot tourist destinations, ladies and gentlemen. And a fortress. Oh, wow. I didn't realize this was at the top of here. Perfect. So now I'm going to... Hmm. 
attempt to not die when I do this. this no, you know, I'm not even risking it. I don't want to die after I've got all this amazing stuff. It would just be stupid. Let's get these blaze rods. There we go. That's all the blaze rods. Now I shall jump in the lava. Hopefully this doesn't kill me. There we go. Oh, it took a little bit of fall damage. It's not often that I get to be super OP in Minecraft. When it does happen, I really enjoy it. Like the portal and see where it takes us. Into a cave. Can you imagine if I was right by diamonds again? I've had like my best ever day for diamonds. To be honest, there's not much else than fortune a thousand... I was wrong. Hold on. Let's get rid of this guy. Get out of there. It's actually very, very useful with lapis as well. Look at how much lapis you get. Oh my goodness. I mean, you get a lot of lapis as it is, but with fortune, it's like the gold ore all over again. I do not have the inventory space for that, so we're leaving it behind. When it comes to gravel, it also increases your chance of getting flint to 100%, which is kind of nice if you want to get a lot of flint. Or to get flint 100% of the time, you don't need fortune 1000. <laughs> Literally, fortune 3 is good enough for that. I'm also feeling like I can take out this guy. That's it. <laughs> we got the bad omen. Probably see where this stronghold goes. If I find a village, I will do a raid, but if I don't find a village, then I'll... I'll leave him in peace. Uh-oh. <laughs> I see a village up ahead. Could I do this? Am I really this evil? <laughs> you bet I'm this evil. I'm sorry, guys. Wait, where's the bell? Somebody go and ring the bell. Somebody's ringing it. Who's doing it? Wait, does a villager do it? They know. Guys, guys, come on, panic. Whoa, they go and ring it themselves. That's it. Get inside, guys. No, no panicking. All right, we've, we've got an attack. What part of get inside didn't you understand, you stupid villager? No, you deserve to die if this is what's going to happen. I, oh, I, I'm actually nearly going to die myself, actually. I just... I just realised I'm not as powerful as I thought I was. That's it. Run from the village, good sir. No, don't run back at him. He's not very clever, is he? This might be the first time I've actually ever done a raid on hardcore mode. I have no idea how it's going to go. I shall distract them with my diamond blocks. That's right. You guys don't stand a chance. <laughs> That's it. Slay your own people. See, they don't know what they're doing. They just took out their own guy. Although there's an actual... Did you just take out a baby village? I didn't think they did that. That is... That is evil. Whoa. All right. I'm sorry, village, what I've done to you, but I swear I will avenge that poor baby. Uh-oh, the, the big fella's here, and to be honest, I don't know how to deal with him. I, I ain't Gollum. I need your help, unless I lay an intricate trap. Ah, you've fallen for my trap. You're now stuck down here. Well, you are, but... Well, you are now. And then all I have to do is just end the pearl away. <laughs> See you later, guys. And so the next wave begins. I don't know like you guys at all. Let's get rid of you quick. Bad, bad news, guys. My shield is broken. That was my only useful thing I had. You know what? <laughs> Screw this raid, I can't be bothered anymore. You know, in fact, follow, you, follow me all the way, you guys. You're about to be outdone again. Once again. Outplayed. out tactic, out mastermind. There we go, that's them gotten rid of. Oh, I told them of dying. How the tables have turned now. You can do what you want. Try everything, mate. You don't stand a chance. I hate to say, but I think the only guy that survived this raid is this little fella here. He's gone in here. You, sir, you'll be safe, all right? No need to worry. I'm now going to go and take out the Ender Dragon. I've had enough of this. Going to my calculations, it should be right about here. Sad, sad news. I've run out of diamond blocks. We're going to have to use emerald. No, wait. We can use redstone. We haven't used redstone yet. There we go. Straight in. No problems. This is generated with a mob spawner with no chest. What kind of a joke is that? For that, I am destroying your spawner and trapping you in here with redstone for the rest of your life. Place in me eyes of Ender. What on earth just happened there? Wait a second. I missed one. <laughs> Don't jump into the portal without putting them all in, guys. That's never a good idea. I've also just realized that I didn't bring enough wood to make many beds. I only have four beds. <laughs> We're going to have to one cycle the dragon with four beds. We can do it. Okay, come on. All right. Every hit has to be absolutely perfect. Here we go. And that first hit, not good enough. Oh, no. Oh, no. I did the wrong thing. It's okay. Watch this, guys. Watch this. You ready? All right. It's perched. We get a week. And then she flies away. Alrighty, we're now going to have to destroy all the towers. This is going to be hard work. Hard work for an average player, but not for SB. I have like a million enderpearls. This shouldn't be a problem. Let's break this first one. And I shall enderpearl my way across. There we go. This dragon doesn't stand a chance. Tower number two. This is a very different way to battle the ender dragon. If I enderpearl straight into it. Oh, look at that. I could just enderpearl into them and they explode without hurting me. Bows and arrows. <laughs> Who needs bows and arrows when you've got pearls? I nearly died there. But don't worry, I've got a total of undying. I, I cannot. You missed. <laughs> you suck. This is one where I've got to do a perfect block clutch. There we go. And a perfect block clutch we just did. Ender Pearl down here. This might be the most fun Ender Dragon fight I've ever done in my life. And there you have it. They're all done. We could do a 360 thing. Oh no, I dropped my water bucket. Wait, I have a total of undying. No need to worry, guys. And there you have it, guys. Beat him. Are you kidding me? You just undermined me right there, Dragon. Get back here. As I was saying, there you have it, guys. Minecraft Hardcore beaten with Fortune 1000.